The U.S. government will work to improve its nuclear forces, a senior military commander has said, pledging to bolster America's arsenal on land, in the air, and at sea in response to rogue actions by North Korea. Speaking before the Senate Armed Services Committee, Air Force General Anthony Cotton spoke of the need to strengthen the nation's nuclear arsenal to meet challenges from the likes of Pyongyang and other rival states. North Korea conducted an unprecedented number of missile launches in 2022 and its new intercontinental ballistic missile, referred to as KN-28, highlight that the security challenge continues to grow, he said. To ensure our continued ability to serve as the bedrock of integrated deterrence, we are recapitalizing every leg of the nuclear triad and the nuclear command control and communication systems. The triad refers to the three primary methods of delivery for U.S. nuclear weapons, including land-based missile silos, long-range strategic bomber aircraft, and nuclear-armed submarines. Cotton went on to accuse North Korea of acting as a rogue nation which poses a threat to the United States and our allies, stressing that Washington must continue to improve its effective and credible nuclear deterrent.